Justin's preparing for Michael Chandler, which is a great fight. Like I, Michael Chandler is the man. Cross. Yeah. I think stylistically, it's a great fight for Justin. Yeah, one, two. So it's gonna be a fun night. It's made for fireworks, so it's gonna be great for the fans. Hey, take a break. Yeah, you hit that right hand. Not switching mitts. We fly out tomorrow, right up a cut left hook. Our team's already out there. Rose flew out today. It's beautiful. And Kamal got out there yesterday, so we're excited to reunite with the team and get everybody together. That's beautiful. God damn, you got a good right hand. That right hand's money. We uh, just made it into New York City. I love this city. It's always great to be here. What's up, dog? How's it going? How you doing, brother? You're yeah, chilling, bro. Huh? Chilling, man. How, How you, you doing, doing, champ? You doing good? Good, yeah. Yeah. Chilling. <laughs> I feel phenomenal as far as like my preparation and everything that I can control. Make sure you go to bed with at least a couple leaders in your post training. Title's on the line, so I'm here to defend my belt uh, November 6th. Thank you. Thank you. It's already come out? Yeah, it's on Netflix number two. I loved Army of Dead, actually. Yeah, like this is people who do. I love zombie movies. <laughs> World War Z. Yeah, yeah. World War Z was awesome. So good. Um, At this point, it's more realistic than it's not. They're not realistic. Yeah. That's why I got a big truck with lights, and <laughs> I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a winch. Uh, I'm gonna bulletproof. The, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna, bulletproof the windows. <laughs> my, my wife's gonna be like, "You're an idiot," because <laughs> she hates zombie movies. <laughs> Just got to the airport here. Uh, in Fort Lauderdale. Got a flight here in about an hour. Head to New York City, baby. Big Apple. It's always great whenever camp is finally over. You know, you, uh, yes, thank you. You got a long road ahead of you when you step into that first week of training camp. I'm down here in Florida, away from my family for eight weeks. So it's nice. It's nice to see the, the light at the end of the tunnel because people see what we do. They see it on YouTube, they see it on Embedded, they see it on the countdowns. Be careful when opening overhead bins, items do tend to move during flight. But they don't quite understand how hard it is and how every single day is Groundhog's Day of just crushing yourself mentally, physically, spiritually, and then having to build yourself back up, battling through bad days, coming back from bad days. So not to make it sound like I don't love it, because I do love it, I love this opportunity, but. Good luck, my friend. Thank you, brother, appreciate it. Good luck. Thank you very much. Nice Thank to you. meet you. You too, brother, thank yeah. you. It's always nice when I go from 10 weeks, 12 weeks of just being a robot. Good afternoon. How are you? Good, very good. To finally getting to unleash the beast and uh, the end all be all, the main goal, get my hand raised, collect my paycheck, get home and kiss my wife. Day one, you know, we flew in last night. He, we're feeling great. He's extremely focused. More focused than I've seen him before, actually, because uh, he's gotten so much better. You know, you're not ever looking at the same guy. You know, he's fought twice since we fought Kobe, and we've had plenty of time to go in the lab and train with Trevor and just build his game, and I'm just so excited for the world to see where he's at right now. I mean, his takedown defense is 100% for a reason. He has the strongest grip, he has the strongest hips, and uh, he's mastered making no mistakes, making everything effortless. So this whatever you want to call it with, with Kobe, we're going to close it out, and, uh, and it'll be the end of that. Now the mindset is starting to, uh, let's get focused a little bit more. Let's start to go off in my head, because that's, that's where I'm going to be in this fight, because no one's going to help you, no coaches, no training partners. You know, it requires you to be mentally in there, present, strong, 
And so I like to take myself there every training session, and now it's starting to starting to really feel real. When I say feels real, it means that that start to sharp mind of me going and being present in the fight. I start to hone in, I start to picture every scenario, every obstacle that I might face in the fight, how to deal with it, how to find a way out of it. And that's something that I do better than anybody in the world right now. And that's finding a way to win. Your dad was telling me about it. you started karate, and then when you turned seven, you yeah, you he, he made you watch a, a MMA fight. Yeah, he watched Ken Shamrock. Yeah. Yeah, you want to be a good fighter and not get picked on or bullied, then you better wrestle. Yes, good advice. Good advice. We got in last night from the plane, and you know, and this is the first time to get on mats and, and really feel each other out and just kind of get a little shake out and get the rust off you a little bit and, and just start game planning and start visualizing of what we're going to do on Saturday night. I said, you sit up. You try to sit up and go forward. Yes. Yeah. 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 All right. Uh, these students learn how his style is like by me training with him every day. So, you know, I think that's a great way to, to teach my students, you know. So I, I like to stay in good shape and uh, train with these guys every day. He's on the battle lines. You know, these coaches are taking pictures, taking selfies. Oh, look at me, I'm with the fighter. We're coaching each other. This guy's getting on the mat, getting down and dirty, on the front lines with us. When this is your craft and you know you want to keep evolving and keep getting better, you gotta keep learning every day. I realize that, you know, I can get better in a lot of areas and I can keep improving day by day, but you know, I have to have an open mind and, and I love learning, you know, especially from world class guys. Every single day you wake up you can get better, but it's only if you got a positive mindset and you're willing to put in the work. Nice. Appreciate it. Thanks, my brother. No, brother. My energy with you, brother. Brother. <laughs> you want to say something embedded? <laughs> yes. Embedded? Yes. I just want to say, brother, I'm tired about embedded. Let me enjoy with my life. <laughs> Why you guys feel like me all the time? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Say, say something about Camaro. No. Brother. He's tired of <laughs> like, this. I, 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 honestly, I really want smash this guy, you know, like he did first time. Let's go, let's go, Kamaru. Pound for pound, best in the world. Thank you, Kamaru my brother. Usman, Nigerian nightmare, Africa <laughs> power. Let's go, brother. I'm with you. Yeah, he just got the brother. best promo. <laughs> <laughs> this is a thumbnail. <laughs>